Hi everyone, welcome to MLT MCQ and Notes. In this video, I am discussing about important multiple choice questions from MLT. First question, which among the following is Ovo Vivi Paris? Option A, Ascari Slum Records. Option B, Strong Eilod Stercoralis. Option C, Trichinella Spiralis. Option D, Tinea. Answer is, Option B, Strong Eilod Stercoralis. What is ovoviviparous? Ovoviviparous producing eggs that develop within the maternal body and hatch within or immediately after release from the parent. Ovoviviparous is producing eggs that develop within the maternal body and hatch within or immediately after release from the parent. Strong Gaylord Circularis is an example for ovoviviparous. And Vucheraria bangrophi is also an example for ovoviviparous. Then strong aloid stercoralis is also known as threadworm. threadworm. Uh, let's see other options. Option A Ascaris lum records. Uh, mature Ascaris female can each lay up to 2 lakhs eggs per day. Mature Ascaris females can each lay up to 2 lakhs egg, eggs per day. Okay, then Trichinella spiralis. Trichinella spiralis is a viviparous nematode that is they give rise directly to larvae. They give rise directly to larvae. Then op other option Tinea. Tinea in Tinea embryonated eggs called ongospheres that are released with feces. In Tinea embryonated eggs called ongospheres are released with the feces. Then second question. Mechanism of action of diphtheria toxin is by option A inhibition of protein synthesis, option B inhibition of lipid synthesis, option C inhibition of DNA synthesis, option D none of the above. Answer is option A inhibition of protein synthesis. The mechanism of action of diphtheria toxin is inhibition of protein synthesis. Then other important toxin like tetanospasmin. Its action is mechanism of action is which inhibit neurotransmitter from CNS neuron. Which inhibit neurotransmitter. Then botulinum toxin which blocks the release of acetylcholine. Acetylcholine which is a principal neurotransmitter. Botulinum toxin block the release of acetylcholine. Then cholera toxin. Cholera toxin act as, acts on animal cells by stimulating the enzyme adenylate cyclase. Adenylate cyclase which catalyzes the production of cycling AMP from ATP. Cholera toxin acts on animal cells by stimulating the enzyme adenylate cyclase which catalyzes the production of cyclic AMP from ATP. Then third question, Medusa head appearance seen in option A, Brucella abortus, option B, Bordetella pertussis, option C, Borrelia burgdorferi, option D, Bacillus anthracis. Answer is option D, Bacillus anthracis. Some important points to remember about Bacillus anthracis are, it's, it was the first pathogenic bacterium isolated in culture. It was the first pathogenic bacterium isolated in culture. It is the largest bacteria. Bacillus anthracis is the largest bacteria. Then Ascoli's thermoprecipitation test. Ascoli's thermoprecipitation test which is used for Bacillus anthracis. Then uh, its capsule is polypeptide in nature. Its capsule is polypeptide in nature. Uh, other bacteria possess polysaccharide capsule. In the case of Bacillus anthracis, which possesses polypeptide capsule. Then string pearl appearance in penicillin agar. Other point is string pearls appearance in penicillin agar. Then McFadian reaction. McFadian reaction. Okay. Let's go through other options. First option, Brucella abortus. The important point is milk ring test. Milk ring test is used for brucella. 
uh, here the dihematoxylin is used the dihematoxylin is used here then sec second option bordetella pertussis uh, in the case of bordetella pertussis thumb print appearance seen in smear from cultures thumb print appearance seen in smear from culture then borrelia burgdorferi borrelia burgdorferi causes lyme disease which causes lyme disease then fourth question small barrel shaped ova are characteristic of small barrel shaped ova ova are characteristics of option a ascaris lambricoides option b anchelas stoma duodenale option c capillaria philippinensis option d enterobius vermicularis answer is option c capillaria philippinensis answer is option c capillaria philippinensis barrel shaped egg is a characteristic feature of trituris tritura we know that barrel shaped egg is a characteristic feature of trituris tritura but trituris tritura is not in the options we are unfamiliar with the capillaria philippinensis we know the rest of the options so leave the rest of the options so the answer is capillaria philippinensis then capillaria is philippinensis is a nematode which causes intestinal capillariasis third one exercise intolerance is the characteristics of option a andersen's disease option b pomps disease option c hers disease option d mccardell's disease answer is option d mccardell's disease mccardell's disease is a genetic disorder that mainly affect skeletal muscle it is a glycogen storage disorder type 5 it is a glycogen storage disorder type 5 It occurs due to deficiency of enzyme muscle glycogen phosphorylase. It occurs due to deficiency of enzyme muscle phos muscle glycogen phosphorylase. Then let's go through other options. Option A: Andersen's disease. That is a glycogen storage disease type four. Type four caused by inborn errors of metabolism. Then Pomps disease. It is a glycogen storage disease type two. glycogen storage disease type 2 it also a genetic disorder then hers disease this a glycogen storage disease type 6 type 6 it also an inherited disorder once again andersen disease a disease is a glycogen storage disease type 4 pomps disease is type 2 hers disease glycogen storage disease type 6 then mccardell's disease it is a glycogen storage disease type 5 sixth question figlo excretion test is used to option a niacin deficiency option b pyridoxin deficiency option c cobalamin deficiency option d folic acid deficiency answer is option d folic acid deficiency figlo stands for form immunoglutamic acid it is a intermediate metabolite in l histidine catabolism in the conversion of l histidine to l glutamic acid figlo is an inter intermediate metabolite in l histidine catabolism in the conversion of l histidine to l glutamic acid in the presence of folic acid deficiency figlo cannot be metabolized a large quantity therefore excreted in urine then uh, let's go through other options niacin deficiency which leads to pellagra then pyridoxin deficiency that is vitamin b6 deficiency which leads to mental status changes normocytic anemia glossitis depression etc then cobalamin deficiency that is vitamin b12 which causes anemia seventh question antigen along with antibody is detected in which generation of htv elisa test option a first generation option b second generation option c third generation option d fourth generation answer is option d fourth generation elisa that is enzyme linked immunosorbent assay 
uh, in first generation used infected viral cell lysate as antigen. In second generation, it uses glycopeptide that is recombinant antigens. Third generation uses synthetic peptides that are used as antigens. First generation used infected viral cell lysate as antigen. Second generation used glycopeptide that is recombinant antigens. Third generation which uses synthetic peptides as antigen. In fourth generation antigen along with antibody is detected in fourth generation ELISA. Then eighth question. Carcinoembryonic antigen is a tumor marker in option A colorectal cancer, option B hepatoma, option C ovarian cancer, option D pancreatic cancer. Answer is option A colorectal cancer. Carcinoembryonic antigen that is CEA which is a tumor marker for colorectal cancer. Then hepatoma that is hepatic cancer. The tumor marker is serum alpha fetoprotein AFP. Then in ovarian cancer CA125 is the tumor marker. Then in pancreatic cancer tumor marker is CA19 19 to 9. Then breast cancer CA15 to 3 that is the tumor marker. Then in prostate cancer PSA prostate specific antigen which is the tumor marker. Then ninth ocean EMJH medium is used in the cultivation of option A bacillus cereus, option B Neisseria gonorrhea, option C leptospira interorganus, option D chlamydia trachomatis. Answer is option C leptospira interorganus. In the case of bacillus cereus, MYPA medium is the selective medium that is mannitol yolk polymyxin B agar medium. Then Neisseria gonorrhea, Thayer Martin medium is used as the selective medium for the cultivation. Then in the case of Chlamydia trachomatis which cannot be grow on conventional bacteriological medium. Tissue culture and egg inoculations are preferred method for the cultivation. Then 10th question. Cardiolipin is option A phosphatidyl ethanolamine, option B phosphatidyl inositol, option C phosphatidyl glycerol, option D dipalmitoyl lecithin. Answer is option C phosphatidyl glycerol. Depending upon the structure of the alcohol, Phospholipids are classified into five and cardiolipin is most important in blood clotting. Phosphatidyl glycerol is the major component of many bacterial membranes. Then 11th question. Swimming pool granuloma is caused by option A. Mycobacterium cancer C. Option B. Mycobacterium ulcerans. Option C. Mycobacterium marinum. Option D. Mycobacterium smegmatis. Answer is option C. Mycobacterium marinum. Which include non-tuberculous mycobacteria. That is a typical mycobacteria. Mycobacterium cancer C causes opportunistic infection. And mycobacterium ulcerans causes bur burrily ulcer disease. Burrily ulcer disease. Then mycobacterium smegmatis causes skin infection. Pneumonia, cellulitis, etc. Mycobacterium marinum, which causes swimming pool granuloma. Then 12th ocean. Iodine number indicate option A, molecular weight of the fatty acid, option B, length of carbon chain, option C, degree of unsaturation, option D, degree of hydrolysis of fat. Answer is option C, degree of unsaturation. Degree of unsaturation of fat or oil. It is defined as the number of grams of iodine absorbed by 100 gram of fat. Iodine number is defined as the number of gram of iodine absorbed by 100 gram of fat. Iodine number is a degree of unsaturation of fat or oil. Then 13th question. River blindness is caused by option A. Drachengulus medinensis. Option B. Oncocerca valvulus. Option C. Vucereria bancrofti. Option D. Loa loa. Answer is option B. Oncocerca valvulus. Which causes oncocerciasis. Transmitted by black flies. Oncocerciasis or river blindness. 
Then let's go through other options. Drachengulus medinensis, which is guniverm. Guniverm. Then Vicheraria bangrofti, which causes elephantiasis. Elephantiasis. Then Loa Loa, which causes Loiasis. The symptoms include calabar swelling, that is localized angioedema in skin. Localized angioedema in skin. 